Hi everyone, so I know it's been like a really, really, really long time since I've done a video, and I'm gonna be honest, I really don't have any, like a big excuse for that besides just being busy with work and being lazy when I get off of work. So yeah, I'm back, and hopefully we can keep this going because I don't know, I don't not like filming, it sucks, but I, don't know, I, like, I like doing it, it's just stuff gets in the way, but you know, I'm back. I say that and then I'll probably not make a video for six months, but you know what, we're going to try really, really hard. Um, so I'm going to do a video on, of course I have nothing to pop up. I'm going to do a video on how I use 9 to 5 cleansing lotion. I really haven't seen any videos on people using this. Um, I did make a video on another makeup remover kind of cleansing thing from Lush and that was Ultra Bland. That was a couple months ago and a lot of people like that video, so I'm going to do 9 to 5 because... I didn't talk about that, and I'm, like I said, I haven't seen a lot of things on it. So, um, I think I'll kind of compare the differences between Ultra Bland and 9 to 5 first. Ultra Bland is a lot thicker, and it's gonna, it's more tacky, and it's also a bomb, so it comes in a pot. Um, Ultra Bland can leave a residue behind, and it's a lot more moisturizing than this, first of all. So, if you have dry skin, um, dry skin, or, um, even if you have acne because that has honey in it and honey is antibacterial, I think you'd prefer that one. Or if you just want something lighter, um, you have oilier skin, you just don't like anything heavy on your face, I think you'd really like 9 to 5 because it doesn't leave a residue behind. This one has Dove Orchid in it, which is really moisturizing. Um, but I find that it's not as moist. This isn't as moisturizing as Ultra Blend. However, it is moisturizing. Um, has almond oil in as well, which is like the finest oil you can put on your face because I feel, I've learned that from like watching like a million Lush videos. Um, let's see. So at first I really didn't like this product. Um, I got this back in December and I was just using it with water and I didn't like the way that it just, I didn't like the way it did and I found that it didn't do anything. So um, what I started doing, which is the way I do it now and I love the way it goes, um, I put this on a cotton round. Um, the cotton rounds that I use are the Studio 35 organic cotton rounds. You can get these at Walgreens. I don't just any regard any organic cotton round will do. I, these are the only ones I've ever seen, and I just like these a lot better because they're not as abrasive on the skin, and um, it just absorbs the product a lot more. So you won't have to use as many cotton rounds. I only find I need to use two. So, anyways, I just pour it on there, like a quarter size amount, and I start rubbing it on my face and it all the makeup will get on here and um, I find that it takes off all my makeup um, except my mascara I use waterproof mascara because my eyelashes are stupid basically um, and uh, so first off I'll take off my eye makeup remover with like an oil based remover and then um, I'll take off like that a lot of times that can leave residue so I'll go over it with this and all my makeup will be off and then I follow through with um, my purity face wash to make sure everything is off my face and cleansed. Um, I know it's kind of, maybe it's kind of a lot, but I really like to make sure my makeup is off before I go to bed because if there's anything, my skin will freak out. Um, so I think this is a really, it's a better alternative than to use makeup wipes. I don't, I really don't like using makeup wipes. I find that my skin breaks out whenever I use them because it's too much on my face. But this is, these both are very, very gentle, so if you have super sensitive skin, I think you'd like this a lot. Um, it comes in two different sizes. I got the biggest size, which isn't really that big. Um, it's the 8.4 ounce, and this was like $20. And then the smaller one is like this big, and it's like $10. So go with just the bigger size, because um, I think you'd really like it, and there's just you, it's a better buy than to buy, to buy the bigger size. And um, like I said, I've had this since December. And I've used it every single night, and still have quite a bit left, so I won't need to repurchase this for a really long time. But yeah, that's how I use 9to5, and like I said, if you have really sensitive um, skin, or you don't like anything that's heavy, um, this would be really, really good. However, if you have really dry skin, or you have acne-prone skin, and you really want to make sure um, to moisturize, then I think... I think you'd like Ultra Blend a little bit more, but I like both. So um, just kind of whatever preference you have. Especially if you don't like something sticky, you won't like Ultra Blend. So I would go with this, which is a lot creamier. So yeah, that's my video. Um, sorry for being kind of awkward. It's been a while since I've filmed. So yeah, thank you so much for watching and bye.